welcome back. Come on back here. I've got this silly little video. We're going to do loaded fries. Some people call them nacho fries. I love French fries. It's one of my favorite things ever. It's my cheat day, so come on and join me. We're going to make all this good. So anyway, my drink of the day is going to be a Shiner Bach right outside San Antonio, Texas, the famous Shiner Company. I know, it's so good. And I didn't know, guys, that his daughter ran this company from like the 30s, 40s. She, The father even wanted to get out of the business because of prohibition, and she said, no, no, I'm going to run it. And she ran this till the 50s or 60s until her death. So there's only 3% of women that own craft beer breweries, and I'm so impressed with that, especially in Texas. I can't believe she got away with it. You don't get away with much here. <laughs> so welcome back, big cheers. We're gonna open up this cool drink. And I've got my cool cat glass, Looney Tunes. And you know what's so sad? He was only six episodes. I just found out. Six episodes and 1967's Looney Tune. He, they brought out the cool cat and he didn't do very well and they kind of stole him on the pink panther and his guy and i don't know it's kind of weird it's kind of sad but i thought 67 that's when i was born so what a coincidence that this is my favorite glass got it for christmas from paul probably three years ago i love it one of my favorite so big sip let's try this cool beer mm. oh yeah oh yeah it's a little stronger than i'm used to i'm a light beer girl you know, I, I like to see through my beer. <laughs> this one's a little darker, but it's super good, guys. Very refreshing. Getting a little hot here. We're about to touch 90, 95. Getting pretty hot. Got the ponytail going. Got the, got the shorts on already. So, welcome back. It's going to be a long, hot summer. Mm. Let's load up some fries and let's have some lunch. So, I already got started. Did my fries really crispy. 425. 400, about 425 minutes straight out of the freezer. Use the Orida ones, my favorite brand. Mm, here they are right here. This is my favorite brand. I'm not kidding. I mean, you can buy the Kroger, you can buy whatever, but this is the best one. Also along with the tater tots too, I noticed. Tater tot ones on Orida are my favorite. Like I told you, I didn't know that was Oregon and Idaho until Jim's Kitch Kitchen, he loves tater tots. He was talking about it and I said, heck, that's my favorite. You know, and I'm all the way down here. So I got started with some taco meat. I used the fries, just bake them. I like mine crispy. If you don't like them crispy, go a little lower. You are gonna coat your pan with a little bit of oil and foil, and that's gonna help with the cleanup and they don't stick. But this is this came out great, guys. They're real crispy, I like them. They got a little bit of a snap to them. Mm, super good. You're gonna dress them up the way you want to. These are on all the taco trucks and the price goes from $10 to $14, at least around here and in Vegas. Because I was gonna get some in Vegas and I thought, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a mess. I was kind of dressed up to go out and I thought, oh, I'm not getting these. I thought, but I wanted to try them. So I got my taco meat. Use whatever meat you want, guys. You wanna use sausage, you wanna use uh, bacon, you wanna use carne guisada, brisket, I used a turkey taco meat. I seasoned it. I like it because that's just what I like on my tacos. So I made these into my taco fries. I'm gonna dress these up. I'm gonna add a little bit of tomatoes on top. So yummy. I'm gonna add a little bit of olives. And I'm gonna add a little bit of the jalapenos. Just kind of drizzle those on there. I'm gonna also add my cheese, of course. You can use the nacho cheese that you would drizzle across the wet cheese. I didn't want to today. I had some and I thought, no, I just want, I just want my, my french fries to look like nachos today. It just looked good. It goes a long way. I can eat these for lunch and dinner and I'm hungry, like I tell you. I don't eat till I get on here and then I start eating. And to make it at the very end, you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna use a little dollop of sour cream and guacamole. Oh my gosh, it's like heaven on a plate. So good, so good. So I'm gonna try this out. There is no magic of TV today because I'm eating this. I just made it and I'm eating this. So let's see, let's see, let's see. What should we do? Oh, I've had a great week, guys. I went to the casino. Oh my gosh. 
I went, I know, I gotta drive a long way. I went three and a half hours, three hours all the way across that border down there in Louisiana. And I got the hot seat deal. I'm gonna be posting a picture of me with a big bottle. They gave me a huge bottle of vodka, which I gave to my bestie. I'm not a big vodka drinker. I gave it to Bunny. And I won the hot seat challenge deal where you're just sitting there and they come pick you. You have to have your card in. You have to be playing. And I hit it for a thousand dollars. So I had all this free play and we made, we each made about 1200 off that money. So we were so excited off of that free play. It was awesome. It was awesome. I had such a good time. It was Wednesday night. Let me try this. Let me try this. Uh, okay. I think the best way to eat this guys is with a fork. Mm. Oh my gosh. Guys, I got to tell you, it's the best. Two thumbs up. I always wanted to try this on a, on a weeknight. I mean, you know, on a weekend when we're out. I never did. I sure am glad I tried it on my own because it's hot, it's spicy, it's salty. It's everything I like. You know, I can't eat like this every day, like I tell you. Tomorrow I'll be back on salads, walking, riding my bike, doing everything I can to be healthy. But today I'm like, the heck with it. I'm having myself a good meal. The avocado tastes good with it, which well, I never would put fries in avocado, but on this, guys, it's fantastic. It's fantastic. I recommend this. Make this, let the kids help. It's a lot of fun. I'll be enjoying this, but come on back real quick for my silly little craft. Let me get this out of here. Let me get this out of here. Where can I put this? Let me put this over here. Okay. Okay, if you go swimming or you go to the pool, we all need a, let me take my bracelet off, so I can take my jacket off. We all need a little cover up. You know, unless you're walking to your car in your bathing suit, we all need a cover up. So I made one. So here it is. Here's my cover up. These are the dollar store scarves. They sell them everything, everywhere. I have an AOA dollar store at my mall. But if you don't, I think they have them at Dollar General too. And it's just a scarf, guys. I bought it for a dollar. It's gonna be my cover up. If you wanna make a belt, you're gonna take a little strip off the bottom of the hem and you're gonna tie this. But I don't need a belt just, you know, at the beach or whatever. I just need something kind of light over this. So let me show you how easy this is. Okay, let's see here. Let's get, let's do, let's do this one. Okay, I have two. Any kind of scarf works, you're just gonna need a big square. That's how easy this is. And you're gonna take your square and you're gonna fold this in half. Just, just right down the middle, just fold it in half. Here it is, here's the whole scarf. You're gonna fold it in half and you're gonna place this down and you're only gonna go up the middle on one part. Only on one part, not both. Don't go both, because if you go both, you're gonna have two pieces of fabric. You know, you're gonna have four pieces of fabric. So let's see here. No big deal, it's not rocket science. You just go right up the middle and let me see, I think that's enough. Let's see, yep, yep, that's pretty good. Might go a little bit more because I wasn't measuring properly. Okay, and that made another one. So as you can see, I opened up one panel only. Gonna go over this. Gonna have another little one. So it's one scarf, guys, $1.25. Not gonna cost you much. Don't go out and spend the money. Make your own, or you can belt this and make it even nicer but these are just nice or light. You can drive home, whatever you gotta do after the pool or the beach. You can walk into a store. You know, you're not gonna offend anybody in your bathing suit. So I liked it. Something silly, I know. Been making these for a long time, but the scarves are only a buck over at wherever. So you might wanna go out and get one now because I heard the dollar stores are kinda closing and I was sad about that. I know a lot of them are closing. So anyway, big sip guys. Happy Sunday, have a good one try this out like i tell you this didn't take long it's just a lot of the good stuff that you like that's what they call loaded fries you just load them up so big kisses mm. try this out keep spinning and winning bye